Hi, I'm Dr. Ajay Kaur. Today we are going to discuss something about replacing aortic valves without open heart surgery or without operations. Now at BLK, it has been our endeavor to uh, make the heart operations or heart procedures very, very simple, safe and effective. And we have been working on this. And today I'm going to discuss something about aortic valve replacement surgery, which till recently was done by open heart method. What we used to do is, we used to replace the aortic valve on heart lung machine and the heart was stopped for some time. Now, this was okay, the results were excellent for many many years and this was the best way to treat aortic valve disease. But what has happened is, recently we get lots of patients who are above the age of say 70-75 years, they are very sick, they have kidney problems, they have liver problems, they have uh, some stroke or something and are not suitable even for general anesthesia. So this poses a lot of problem in managing these patients and some of them are very, very high risk. And you know, it is very frustrating for a surgeon when we tell them that, okay, nothing can be done for you and you are not going to live for more than maybe six months or one year or something like that. But thanks to the new technology and our interest in adapting whatever is latest in the field of uh, cardiac sciences, we have recently started a procedure which is called transcatheter aortic valve replacement. This I will show you a small clipping where we will explain you in great detail how to go about the whole thing. But first thing is no anesthesia is required in these patients. We don't do any heart surgery, we don't stop the heart, we don't give any cut on the chest, nothing is done. It's just a simple procedure where uh, in the groin we just insert a small needle and through that the whole aortic valve procedure is being performed. The advantage is in all those sick patients where we could not even dream of doing any procedure, leave aside heart surgery, even a small procedure where general anesthesia is required could be dangerous. In that, we can do a very complex surgery like aortic valve replacement with excellent results. Initially, this surgery has been performed only for very high risk cases, but gradually we are quite excited about the results in our hospital. And so we are now taking a little moderate risk patients also for these procedures, which is going to be really good for patients who otherwise have small little comorbidities like morbid obesity or are severely diabetic or are redo surgeries where the risk is we of course have a score by which we calculate whether the patient is suitable for this part type of this procedure or not so let us discuss in great detail about how to uh, how this particular procedure is being performed blk super speciality hospital a passion for healing